Hello, Serge here from the Backyard Driving Range. All right, really got a great letter today. It comes to, it comes to, uh, comes in from a, a Michael Shearer. He's from Germany. And uh, just going to give you a, a background on this. Michael contacted me uh, through customer service about three or four months ago. And uh, back at the end of 19, uh, 20, not 19, 20, uh, 2015. And he had just found PPGS and he loved it. And he would, he'd been talking to his pros about it at his club in Germany. And wanted to know if I'd be interested in, in spending some time with them. Because they were interested in learning about the swing. So I think he's got a day worked out where where uh, I'm going to teach at least three of them. And he's, and he's got, they got a couple of friends from other clubs that might come. So I don't know how many is going to show up. So that's going to be pretty nice hit. Maybe we get some, some uh, uh, cert certified instructors in Germany. And the other thing is, is that he also booked himself and, and three of his buddies who we're going to hear about in this, this, this letter for one day all by themselves with me. Okay, so I'll, uh, so I'll, be, doing a, I'll be doing a golf school with them for uh, him and his friends for, for one full day. But he starts out and he says, he said, he, uh, this is Michael writing. Just came back from a one-week training camp in Mallorca, Spain. In the last 20 years, I had several one-week trips in February and March where I play 18 holes every day plus practice sessions. Usually after a couple of days, everything hurts. Back, hip, knees, feet, and so on. I only go through the week with painkillers, massages, rest, etc. I changed my swing to the PPGS last November, so you see he's only been doing it for three or four months now. So I was very interested in seeing how this training week in 2016 would work out body-wise. What I can tell you, I was ama it was amazing. My back, my knees, my hips, nothing hurt. It was fantastic. I brought new golf shoes without breaking them in, so after the second day, I had blisters on my right foot. So I switched to my normal jogging shoes, and here is the amazing thing. I played well with my old swing. There was no chance of playing decent golf in regular jogging shoes. All right, he goes on to say, one more thing. You know how Germans are. For the first two days in training camp, my buddies and I analyzed the PPGS in detail with the exception to copy it with, with the expectation to copy it perfectly. And I mean the German definition of perfect. Obviously, this led to a lot of frustration because we could not do it. Tuesday night after feeling sorry for myself, after four beers, for feeling sorry for myself beers, I decided to quit looking at my videos and just feel the swing. Stay within your parameters, but adapt it to my personal needs. I also decided to just play and have fun and wait for May until you can help me in person. As a result, my Wednesday round was great, and in the evening, your new daily came out. You and the PPGS find your vertical swing, your vertical golf swing. How wonderful. Thank you so much for the, bus, the best body-friendly swing in the world, Michael. All right. Let me talk about that video. And, and, and I guess it was pretty, pretty fantastic that it came out the, the, night, the, the next daily it came out. It was that one. That was the one where I've talked about it a few times, but I really did, I don't think I've ever made a daily till that one about the fact that it's great that you all read the read the manuals that if you get them, watch the videos, watch the dailies, put me on slow motion. I've had people tell me they buy the daily, they buy the videos uh, uh, online, so they got the digital videos or whatever you want to call it, and then they got the then they buy hard copies so they can put them on their bigger TV and sit there and. and be able to see even bigger in, de in closer detail all the particular positions of my swing and try to copy it to a T. Now, again, that isn't going to work because you are not me, just like if, if I'm not you. We all have different body sizes, shapes, tall, short, you know, uh, longer arms, shorter arms, longer legs, shorter legs, different physical abilities and liabilities, right? Many of you got the PPGS uh, got it because you had some, you know, some back, some back issues and other issues, like like Michael just said. And I mean, get pretty serious. Where, you, where you, in many cases you got to lay up off the game for a while. You're in rehab and stuff like that. So <laughs> you got those issues, and you don't want them to come back. But the point of the of be yourself is that you heard him say the magic words, the parameters. All right, he stayed within the parameters. Stay. He said. 
the, the, to have uh, to swing staying within the parameters but adapted to my personal needs that's what you need to do you got to figure out there are some main, there are some majors right one of them is we take it away in the mitt the mitt is if this is my aiming line and the ball's right here the catch is the, the, the mitt's right in behind this over here now the mitts in different places for different people again pace depending on your height and your arm length and everything else okay but once we turn to the toe line that's it there's no more turn it's straight up all right, and then again, once we reach the front toe line, there's no more turning it straight up. So those are the parameters. But you got to figure out, keep it into mind, the words, find in your mind where your body feels the best and can do it the most consistently, time and time again, with the least amount of tension, stress, and strain, and therefore pain. Hopefully, not even less pain, no pain. All right, so that's what happens here. You can't, the pictures, the, word, the pictures are a guide to show you what it looks like but you, in your mind, have to take those words and feel it. And what's going to tell you whether it's happening or not? The results. The impact and the hit. All right? So, y'all can't be, be mini-surges in terms of exactly, exactly the way I swing. Or as Michael called it, German perfect. Right? No. you got to figure out what becomes your perfect within the parameters. So take the words... Develop what you think is the feeling. Film yourself now and then and look at it. And if it looks pretty darn good and it's up to you and, and from takeaway to the top to impact and through and you're finishing in balance, you're hitting it relatively solid or straight, likely shooting lower scores, you know you're on to something, that's what you want to do. And remember, what do I always say about practice swings? I get in my setup, I feel the swing, then I step up and I swing the feel. You don't have my feeling, I don't have yours. So you got to develop your feeling so that when you make that practice swing and you feel the, word, the swing you want, then you sweat, step up and swing your feel, your PPGS. And you'll see you'll be playing, again, hitting a more solid straight, much more consistently, and shooting those lower scores. Well, that's it for the swing today on developing your PPGS swing. Okay, well, that's it. Talk to you again soon.